will live without you. My love Amy, my holidays are going to start from next month. And you started worrying from today. Relax please my sweetheart. Today is our trip. So please, enjoy it to full now. But Mark, you never left me alone here. I know this only, how I will live without you here. Just think about me for once. Amy my love. You don't worry I will call you twice in a day. We will keep in touch my darling. Look Mark. How beautiful and peaceful this place is. I wish we could build a house here for you and me. Amy, you are right here is so much peace and beauty, away from city life. But, let me tell you. This place is not much pretty than you. Lisa my daughter. I'm going out for some important work. Please take care of yourself. I'll see you later. Mama if you don't mind may I ask you something? Yes of course my love. What is that? Mama I don't know. Why I feel that, Edward is not a right person. I didn't get positive vibes from him. Why? What happened did he said anything wrong to you? Tell me truth Lisa. No Mama. He didn't said anything to me. But you know a woman can feel everything. And she even can recognize the bad or good side of a man. But I don't know why, but. Yesterday I feel this strongly. He is not a good person at all. No, Lisa it's not like that my daughter. Yes I agree to this, he is a little bit immature person. But he is not like that bad man. You please relax. Well, you know better than me. I only share with you, what I feel actually. It's your misunderstanding my dear daughter. But, I'm glad that you shared your thoughts with me. I appreciate it. He is so insane person. I told him this before. Don't try to be smart when you come to my home. Now look how Lisa have noticed him and she was telling me about him. And his bad sights. I should talk to him today and must tell him. Don't he dare to even think about my daughter. Many time he showed concern in front of me about Lisa. But this is the right time. I must gave a shut up call to him. Why you called me here today? Because mostly we meet in that yellow cafe. Actually today I was thinking we should check the taste of this restaurant too. That's why I've asked you to come here. Well tell me how are you my love Zoe? Edward now listen. Do you know what my daughter said to me today? What? She said mama that guy looking me with bad eyes. Edward I told you this. Don't try to be smart but you don't listen to me. Now she feel odd about me also. Now what you want? What do you mean by this? What I want? Now listen. Zoe from that day. You are gone from my mind. Now I only think about Lisa. And she will be mine soon. I don't want to be with you anymore. You have no charm to attract me anymore. You are getting old. Edward I'll put you into small pieces. How dare you even to think about my daughter. We both need each other. And we fulfill our needs that's it. If you want to leave me then go ahead, I'll not stop you. But, don't you think to even put a glance of my daughter at all. Arrange my room at your place I will come tonight for Lisa darling. Otherwise, you have no idea what I can do with you. I said stop. Edward stop. No more words. Otherwise don't forget our trip of seaside Madam Zoe. And many more others. I have so much material with me. What do you mean by this? I have many things to show in my phone regarding our last trip and so on. You want to see your nice videos? Or you want that? I should send those to your husband Mark. And show this to Lisa as well? It means, you kept everything in your phone and now you're start blackmailing me. No my love no. I'm just requesting from you and nothing else. Edward she is my daughter you can take money, jewelry and everything from me. But please don't do this with me. 
Please remove everything please I beg you for this. Spare my daughter. She is too small. I think the room on top floor is okay. Yes kindly prepare that room for me. Otherwise you know what will happen with you. Please Edward don't say this. Lisa is my everything. Please don't do this with me. I will come after 7 p.m. Okay now I'm leaving. Bye. I've checked everything Mrs. Mark. Tell me, from how many days you were feeling this pain? Doctor, I don't remember this exactly. But, I think from three to four days. Well do you remember me? We meet two years ago in Smith's wedding. I'm the wife of William Mason. Yes, I remember. We've met there. Well, you work here? Yes I start working here for from few months. Well, your husband Mark is the best friend of my husband. That's good. Why he didn't come here with you today? For getting this good news. Congrats Mrs. Mark. You are pregnant. Nowadays husbands became very careless. By the way when he'll be back from abroad? What did you just said? I'm pregnant. Doctor are you sure? Yes Mrs. Mark you are pregnant. Don't be shocked. This is a good news. After so many years you are getting a child. Yes it has been many years. Well, thanks. Well, you must took a very good care of yourself. I'll tell this good news to my husband. He'll be so happy to know this. Well, we will visit your place to meet Mr. Mark. And we'll congratulate him for this. Actually we are going to another city for a few days. When we will back then I'll let you know. Please give me your contact number. Okay why not sure Mrs. Mark. Now what will gonna be happened? Oh my god. If she told this to her husband and then her husband tell this to Mark. Oh my, no way it can't be real. Is I'm still dreaming. How I get pregnant. No. No Edward you don't do this with me. Now how I will out from all these things. I'm badly entrapped from all four sides. What should I do now? And now this devil start chasing my daughter Lisa. Oh God please save me from all these. What I've done. If Mark will get to know this all. Then a big storm will come. I will be ruined. He will surely leave me. Mark will not spare me at all. And how should I save my daughter Lisa from this person Edward? Just look at him. He didn't come here today with his girlfriend. Maybe they changed the venue due to me. But Edward don't think I spare you man. You will not enjoy anymore. Now just see what I do with you. Just wait and watch. Now it's my turn Edward. Mom still didn't came back to home. I don't know where she go every day without informing me. Just look the time. I'm feeling so scared right now. What are you doing outside? Please go inside Lisa. Mama what happened? Why are you looking so scared right now? Everything is fine? Yes, I'm okay Lisa. But next time please don't come out alone okay? Okay Mama okay. Relax now. Hello how are you all? Thank you for supporting my channel. And please kindly like, share, subscribe, Naja Cartoons. Thank you.